During my time, I was with the boys in USC, boys. That was a very good opportunity. All boys, and I respect them that I will be a new boy. Plus the number of students per class, there were 60. Then there were two sections per period, so 120 per session, per hour. And I had to handle uh, uh, seven hours a day to all boys. And you know, the, that was a challenging job, but I managed to, uh, to teach because I was very young then also. I have all the energy, enthusiasm, dedication to, to do the job. First of all, uh, I want to thank the guys uh, USC Batch 86 for really inviting me and welcoming me with open arms. So, uh, before I came over here, I had a little apprehension of what to expect from my classmates of uh, San Carlos Batch 86. But when, when I arrived, I felt the warmth camaraderie and the friendship is still there after in fact 27 years to be exact because I left from Butua way back in uh, 85 and after 25 years I can see that the friendship is still there and uh, the bond yeah the bond that has been the bond that has been fostered is still very strong and as I've said once a Carolinian will always be a Carolinian whether you have graduated uh, high school whether you haven't finished high school in San Carlos for as long as you have, you've been molded the Carolinian way. The ideals remain, and uh, those ideals will always guide you in life. Now, I could see that a lot of our classmates are very successful in business, in the field of uh, law and medicine, and I'm really proud of them. That, uh, we have uh, an established network of professionals and businessmen. Here in Cebu, not only in Cebu, but all over the Philippines. I'm based in Cagayan de Oro. So if you need anything in Cagayan, especially uh, dental services or whatever, you can always come to my clinic. And uh, I'm so glad that uh, uh, we're able to connect, able to connect uh, because of technology. And uh, uh, this is a good start because. 25th uh, alumni homecoming, otherwise known as the Silver uh, Jubilee, is the best time to come home. You know why? Because we have so much pep and energy that compared to the 50th or the Golden Anniversary, which we all look forward to, it's only your tongue that's active by that time. But now we can still party. We can still play around and we can still have fun together. Hey, he's happy for you, bro! He's a boot ball, bro! Go, go! Go, go! Go, go! Go, go! Go, go! Go, go! Go, go!
Well, I am very excited and very happy that everyone's here. Uh, usually, my, after graduation, I'm very happy about the organization of the basketball alumni uh, basketball. And through that, every now and then, uh, classmates will be able to get So, we can see that all in our batch, but also other batches, like Sige, that's a tapong-tapong, Sige, that's a reunion, and that's a lot of So, I'm very happy that all in our batch, but also in other batches. Fondest memories of an old all boys class could be traced to the different um, activities I have done with the boys. I find them very cooperative, vibrant, and one thing I cannot remember and I find it a very memorable one is. When I go into an activity or go into projects like play productions, turn paper making, these boys are really highly spirited and they never leave you without work undone. Batch 86 is awesome. You see Batch 86 is simply the best. USC Batch 86, Silver Rush. USC Batch 86, Tanawa. <laughs> <laughs>